We are just one day away from the solar eclipse. It's a rare cosmic event where the moon passes in front of the Earth and plunges the sky into complete darkness. And we're bringing you live team coverage of the eclipse. WFMY News 2's Ben Briscoe is live in Dallas, Texas to get the best view of the eclipse. Plus, meteorologist Claire Fry will tell us if the skies will be clear enough to see it. But let's start in Dallas, where hundreds of thousands of people, including our very own Ben Briscoe, is out there. Uh, they have traveled to see the eclipse. Ben, what does the city have planned for this once in a lifetime experience? It is jam packed with activities out here, I Denise. We're at Southern Methodist University where I went to college and this beautiful campus out here that just joined the ACC, by the way, is one of hundreds hosting a watch party tomorrow. City leaders estimate half a million people almost are traveling to North Texas to get a view of totality for three minutes and 51 seconds. Hotels are at capacity and Hertz rental car said they had a 300% increase in people renting. We met folks who spent thousands of dollars just to be here from North Carolina and from as far away as Oregon. They say it was worth it to them after seeing the 2017 eclipse that moved them so much. Everything shuts down. All the birds stop chirping and it just it's so powerful to to see a true eclipse. It's just powerful. I just have chills even just remembering it and thinking about it. It's it's just awe-inspiring. Reminder that I live in a universe, and it makes me feel humble when I see it. It's going to be magical, though. I saw that eclipse in 2017, and I still get chills thinking about it, too. Here's the catch, though. All these people traveled here for the big show, and it's beautiful weather right now, but we are expecting clouds to roll in overnight and build up all day tomorrow. So now a lot of people are thinking maybe they should hit the road and try to chase the sunshine somewhere else. Coming up in just a few minutes, we're going to talk with a physics professor from SMU here who's putting together the party for tomorrow. He'll share why you can still have a great time at the eclipse, even if it's cloudy. Live in Dallas, Ben Briscoe, WFMY News 2.